so we're baby free right now and Michael and I came to have a little day date. What's that? <laughs> um, so we came to go eat the Kimmy. We came to eat some ramen. And this is the place. Super cute place and the food is always so good. I'll show you guys once it gets here. But so far we have I have some iced tea, Michael has some water, and then we have our eggs. We got paid. We what? We got, we got paid. We got, we got our income taxes. Yeah, we got our income taxes, so we got some extra cash, so that's fine. Um, but it's all going towards the house, so that's good, right? That's the place we go to, guys. If you guys live like in the Redondo Beach, Gardena, Torrance. Torrance, LA area, that's where we go, and it's so good. So we made it to Costco. It's 5:40, and they close at six o'clock, guys. Oh my gosh, this is our special date night. It's our romantic. Our, our, our rush through Costco date night. We're gonna take long romantic walks along Costco, and then Michael was helping a old lady right now put his her waters in the car because Michael's such a sweet boy. Aww. No, it's just common courtesy. If you're like. If you're in your 60s or whatever and somebody like some young guy wants to help you put your things in, it'd be nice if they offered. I Not many people do things like that anymore. I hope my kids are like him. I should also point out that this is a new Costco that we're coming to. We've never been to this Costco we before. We don't know anything about this place. We have no idea. But look, they have the X1X, Michael. Yeah, we can't afford it though. According to Michael, we can't afford anything. That's not, you know, that's not bad. This is actually a really good deal. They have a Dyson for $319 and that's with $80 off. This is a Dyson V7, which I think is one of the newer ones. And it's the animal one. So that's pretty cool because it's like extra, um, like it lifts up more and more hair. It's not actually heavy at all. Though. No, it's a lightweight one. That's the one I want, but I just can't bring myself to spending $300 or $400 without the discount on it. There's so many kids books here guys for such a good deal. These four they sell at Target for $20, but it's only $7.99 here and they have three different ones. They have this one, this one, and this one. They have this package of three Dr. Seuss books for $12 I believe. Uh, they just have so many good kids books here guys. You guys are looking for kids learning books, reading books. Any kind of books, I think you guys Master need Sudoku to come here. Books. Sudoku books too. <laughs> What's this? Look at this one. Is this like a puzzle? Oh, 25 mini books for $15. So we weren't really going to buy anything, but we ended up with some things. So we got Michael these books, this one, and then these four smaller books, and a five minute storybook. We got these two. These two um, panels, uh, blinds for the living room, and then Michael got a utility light for the garage. I know you guys can barely see me, but we just left Costco and they had no more churros, so we got a, a chocolate yogurt, frozen yogurt thingy. And oh my god, so embarrassing. I was waiting in line and <laughs> a guy opened up, his like lane opened up, and he's like, next, next. 
Next! And I'm just standing there like this. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh my god, he literally probably yelled it like five times. And there was like a line of like 10 people behind me. Oh my god, how embarrassing. Everybody was like, next, excuse me, next. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> I felt so embarrassed. <laughs> Good morning. So it's Sunday now and I totally didn't vlog the rest of our night yesterday. But after the clip you guys saw, I think we just went to go pick up the baby and then we came back home. Um, but when we were at Costco, I showed you guys that we got these right here. And Michael's actually going to put them on right now. Come here. So he's back here unscrewing our curtain. I mean current curtains. Wow, that's like a tongue twister. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna put these up and I'm excited. They're like a light blue, so I'm not sure if they're really gonna work. <laughs> That's your tickle spot, huh? <sighs> okay, so the living room's a little cray right now, but what do you guys think? I kind of like it. So it's like a different shade of blue, but that pillow right there is like a navy blue, but I think it looks okay. Kind of matches that cabinet right there where we put our shoes. Definite. Oh, <laughs> it just fell. It definitely matches those candle holders right there, which I actually didn't want to keep, but now that that matches, I might actually keep it. Hey. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think because I kind of like them. I think they look good. Get down, sit down. I think they look good. Hey guys, so the day has gone by and I just didn't pick up the camera at all, but we went to the mall, we shopped around a little bit, and I wanted to show you guys what we picked up. So literally, this is like one of the first times where we go to the mall and the trip is basically just for me like it literally almost was just for me so we went to cotton on and everything i bought at cotton on was only seven dollars which was nice did you see that everything was seven dollars hey you should uh, actually tr show it on try it on for them do it like do this video and then like later on tonight or tomorrow add a, a, a put it on. or okay. cl clip it in with them maybe i'll do that then okay so this is the first shirt i got it's just like a regular t-shirt and it has like a little pocket on here. I thought this would be cute. Just I used to have one like this a long time ago, but I made a hole in it and I don't have it anymore. And then I got this one and this one's just like a really flowy tank top one. And it's kind of like a t-shirt material and it's just long and flowy and then the back is longer than the front. And I liked it, it was super comfy. Whoa. I'm trying to do this in a hurry because my parents are gonna come over in a little bit. And then I picked up this one, which I thought was super cute too with the little strappies in the front, which I thought was so cute. And I think these were all a size medium. And then this was like totally out of my comfort zone, but it's not like weird or anything. But I got this like potato sack dress and this one I got in a size small and it's so cute. Oh, sir. <laughs> Um, yeah, I got this one in a size small, but it's super cute. I'm normally, I always like the look of potato sack dresses, but they never look good on me because I just look so much bigger. This is what it looks like, and then it has like little pockets right here. It's so, so cute. Mm -hmm. 